My name is Michael. My name's Anthony. It's like about a he half an inch no longer. Yeah. You still gotta get those kegs. Come at me, yo, bitch. Good <laughs> show, everybody. Hello, everybody. Oh, shit. My bad. There we go. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to M&A's Excellent Adventures, where my name's Michael. My name is Anthony. And we are here with the one and only motherfucking Bob Buell himself. Oh, let's go. oh my God. What an intro. Thank you, gentlemen. It's an honor. It's an honor. Absolutely. And we're going to tell you a story today. Absolutely. Uh, as some of you saw with that weird audio thing going into it, uh, I don't have the audio clip on my work computer, which we're zooming over. So I just pulled one up from YouTube and used the <laughs> intro from there. So this is going oh, it's great. great. Mm -hmm. but we have a fantastic, mm -hmm. fantastic episode for everybody today because, as I said, we've got a lister extraordinaire Bob Buell <laughs> hashtag devilish on the pod. Why so, is my name that? How long has my name been that? No. Oh no. I, I just thought you were feeling devilish today. I'm kind of feeling <laughs> a little bit devilish in a way. <laughs> if I had to describe myself in a word, <laughs> I don't know. I guess we... <laughs> devilish would be good. We've we've devolved to prop comedy. Now. <laughs> minute 30 in perfect yeah, everyone right. take your bets we're like carrot stop am i right yeah. nice. very nice so bob uh before we kind of start getting into it why don't you tell the listeners millions and millions of listeners of a little bit about who you are as if they <sighs> me little old me a capricorn born in the mean streets <laughs> of new jersey in fact the great state in the top one percentile of states and i will not take follow-up questions on that point uh i'm just a humble man making it through a hard scrabble world day by day lay by lay uh and i enjoy well life <laughs> very good. uh i also have a podcast 99 questions if you want to listen to it it's, it's pretty good um very good very good <laughs> that was the most dramatic uh intro i think we've ever had to a guest before and that's half a semester of theater class baby <laughs> nice, <Right off>. dude. <laughs> this is Perfect. also our first guest who like i don't know and never mind. I don't know. I'm not gonna finish that thought. Never mind. Well, it's like <laughs> I, if, if you, it, it is our first guest that's not like a close friend. That's what family. it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. want to sound like a dick, but like <laughs> our first total stranger of a guest. Yeah, our first <laughs> uh, is our first cool guest. Is what I was going to say. Uh, of course, of course. <laughs> yeah. As Bob said, he has the. Uh, fantastic interview podcast 99 questions oh. it is supremely entertaining definitely check that out uh and then bob and i are connected through the vi podcast world which i've mentioned many times on this show too many before. times <laughs> or not enough not or enough. not enough i've plugged sure. jeff and riley almost as much as i've plugged this show on this show so <laughs> It's a great world. It's a great it world. Is a great, a it's of. a good, yeah, it is. It's a hundred percent a part of my identity. I, I, if, if, yeah. So yeah, hundred percent. That's just the kind of world that we live in. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. people's world and we're all just VI podcasts of it. Mm -hmm. so, as Langston Hughes once that's what said. I was say. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so Anthony, what do we do on this show? We tell stories on this show, but they're fun improvisational stories. Uh, kind of some mind, you know, you know mind tweakers and, and, and some uh, some really cool uh, backbreakers. And my personal <laughs> favorites are the are the lust weavers. But uh, we tell weaver. improvisational stories that uh, the host puts together. And so Michael this week 
knows what's going on. Oh, I don't know. Bob doesn't know. No and <laughs> that's pretty much the fun stuff is, uh, you know, nobody knows except the one who knows, you know. And I'm the one who knows. So okay. I am the one. Don't weigh a ton. Don't need a gun to get respect. Anthony, that's enough. That's yeah. enough. Copyright circuit. <laughs> Immediately. Copyright. The whole now, taken now, down. now we're not on YouTube I didn't do the rhythm. Anymore. I just said the words. You can't copyright the words. <laughs> it was too perfect. It was too perfect. That is true, actually. That's right. The that emphasis is on yeah. don't weigh your ton. Uh, yeah, that might get YouTube to pull it down. Probably. Hashtag not monetized. So, you know. That is true. We're not that monetized. That is true. So that we can say true. whatever we want. So Is this- it a hum... Is it a humble brag to say that we don't make any money off of this? <laughs> like, it's like, we have enough to income outside of it to sustain it. But like, mm. so it's almost like, you know, we're not big enough to make cash, but we are rich enough to keep going. Wow. What an allegory. <laughs> Truly. That's what I'd like to take away from our situation. So what you're saying is this podcast does not have a sponsor. So Correct. if I were to say that you can use promo code Buell for your own Manscaped 4.0, 20% off and free shipping. The code is live, people. It's wireless charging. It's got a light attachment. It is made for all your most sensitive of areas. Promo code Buell, 20% off and free shipping. If what you're saying is like something like that would just not really have a home here, right? Uh, n- not particularly. Oh. Of course, of course. Um, so yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I saw. Sure. So thank you for for checking in, and I'll ask you not to do that. Of course. Well, of course. specifically, I'm just asking. You know, what if I want to trim down there, fuel? Uh, <laughs> I mean, for the most sensitive of areas, you can obviously use the Manscape 4.0 <laughs> electric razor. Uh, not sponsored, but could not, be not not, at all. not sponsored by us. By sponsored us. by. <laughs> I just want people to get a good deal. Is all I'm saying. You're leaving money on the table if you're not using a promo code. So uh, know your role. You're not the captain of this ship. <laughs> of course. <right? laughs> of course. So I'm just saying, if there's a man that needs scaping. <laughs> I have looked into Manscaped and I guess I'm going to have to use Buell when I make, when I finally, finally just have the huevos to, to pull the trigger and go for it. Hey, pull the hop, 4.0 trigger. Hot boy summer suck, uh, coming. It's coming around the corner. True. That's true. And I do just have saying. another baby to make. So, <laughs> well, you know, since we're kind of going into the whole, um, you know, not sponsored thing, I just want to say uh, the number one provider of uh, pre Mac package meals, uh, Blue Apron. <laughs> <laughs> don't give them free ad Chef space Barrett, no one's getting Chef anything favorite, from that well this family friendly guarantee not sponsored but uh, of course it not. could be of course but not. it could be yeah, yeah we, we've could... sometimes dms we'll are just, open we'll we'll plug a product and hope that they'll reach out to us and be like hey thanks maybe we can sponsor you so sometimes <laughs> like we've plugged i think pepsi before or coke caribou caribou <laughs> several nice. times uh yeah so so you know we just are we're kind of the bad boys of the podcast world you know, that's we don't play sure. by corporate yeah. rules no we're just if, smucks that's corporate. right that's right <laughs> you keep throwing up more hashtags and i like <laughs> that the whole sentence is hashtag <laughs> hashtag we're not corporate puppets <laughs> corporate world <laughs> we're just used by them <laughs> yeah. We don't get like paid, but we get laid <laughs> sometimes. Hey. 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 <laughs> so with all of this, I'm really reading in between the lines. And Bob, what I'm hearing mm. is that you're drooling, pooling energy, and it's grueling, and you're in need of a cooling because oh. of how much you're just wanting to scream Mm -hmm. tell me a story tell me a story tell me a story (laughs) so with that let's jump on in oh is there a powerpoint there's a powerpoint oh Oh, baby oh there's a powerpoint baby i was hoping there was okay i gotta move some stuff around on my screen there we go now we're good now we are good okay so 
Yeah. Oh, we are slick with the transitions. Uh, it, it, we're pros at this. So introducing Bob's character. <clears throat> Bob, your name is now Benny Carlson. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Benny Carlson. If you do need to take notes during this, feel free. Oh, I got gotcha. you. You studied philosophy for a semester and it made you think you're really deep and decided to start a podcast about it called 99 Questions with Benny Carlson. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, 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 um, yep, yep. You average about 50 to 75 listeners per episode and in your eyes, that makes you a superstar. And you're excited for a weekend at the lake with your pals. Nice. Benny Carlson's excited for a weekend at the lake. Next up here, we've got Anthony's character. Who, oh, me? You are Chud Mickelson. <laughs> I can't even hide from the camera because it follows me. <laughs> <laughs> it's chasing you. It's chasing you. You are Chud, Chud Mickelson. Mickelson. Got it. <laughs> for for context, Bob, I I always try to give Anthony the worst name I could think of. Uh, so Pretty oftentimes good. it's just noises. But um, <laughs> you once partook in a dirt bike race at Thunder Valley Motocross Park in Lakewood, California, and God forbid that you don't share that information with everyone you meet. Screenshotting right now. <laughs> Whoa. Thunder oh. Valley Motocross Park in Lakewood, California. Everybody's got to know. Everybody. Got it. Uh, you could have gone pro if it weren't for an injury. Mm -hmm. And you absolutely love spending time with the boys. I'm seeing a theme here amongst the characters. And lastly, my character, Banks McKenzie. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I was very sheltered as a youth. Okay. Just like the historical Banks McKenzie. Just like the historical <laughs> Banks McKenzie. But I'm always willing to tag along with my buds. Maybe mm. I'm not the biggest go-getter in the world, but you know, if 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 my friends are are into it, then I'm I'm ready to go. However, I also bring along my <laughs> tripling anxiety. Mm. <laughs> Got it. Wow. <laughs> Shyamalan style what That's a twist right. <laughs> so let's set the scene we've arrived at our beautiful lake cabin Ooh. and we're getting ready Ooh. we're unloading well uh this must be it guys we're this is a really nice place actually oh man I really love the mountains uh the trees it really reminds me of the uh, you know, Redwoods, but specifically reminds me of Thunder Valley Motocross uh, Park at uh, Lakewood, California. Uh, right, right. Yeah. Do you no. remember when I did that? I, I uh, studied abroad out in California and, uh, you yep. know, got my legendary injury, but uh, yep. specifically, specifically, uh, you know, it's biking. I just, yep. fuck, you guys want to go on a bike ride? No, um, I'm okay right now. Actually, I'm. I. I. Um, I. I think I. I'm okay without doing that. Okay. But yeah, um, yeah me too. I'm me just, too. Me too. I. Yeah. I. I kind of just want to get unpacked. How about you, Benny? Just kind of, Benny's um, got the beer skis. Benny! Hey. Oh, that's good. Good. Hey. Bike ride. Uh, Benny. If, <laughs> Sorry. Benny. Bike ride. Chad, I think. I. Chad, I think we. Oh, he's maybe we. Thing again. Um, okay. Uh, maybe we should go inside. Okay, um, cool. And get yeah, 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 sure, settled. sure, sure. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, so, yeah. so I'll just take the case. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, do whatever you want. Do whatever so, we head thing. inside to this beautiful cabin, mm. and it's just gorgeous in here. Oh, fantastic. I, I guess we should divvy out rooms. Uh, um, ben do Benny. they have like an A lister suite somewhere, or like, a, <laughs> um, like, so it, it, do they have like a, a turndown or like room service or something like that? or? I don't know. I I don't Weird. think so. Just like some somebody of my caliber, like I can't. Oh. Like I can't. You know, I can't just like. I don't want to. You know, I don't want to sound like I'm not a prima donna. You know what I mean? But I, like, I just. It's just tough going back to like the pedestrian life. No. You know? I, yeah. It's. You know, I, I kind of. I'm so sorry. From, I didn't. Yeah. You, know, you know. Remember when I was almost a celebrity? Uh. You know. Thanks. So uh, yeah, um, I'll do better next time with booking. I just thought maybe this like was kind of nice. Um, no, this is fine. But you guys, you yeah, guys can yeah, take the fine. rooms. Then fine, I'll, fine I'll for, just take the couch if you because then you can kind of have your space and and yeah. everything there. 
Um, yeah. So that might be a lot of fun. So we can get that set up. Um, yeah. And then Actually, the beers, you know, wherever you want. Banks, if you, yeah. you know what? Yeah, I think you should take the couch. How do they think about it? Yeah, I think you should. Yeah, oh, yeah please. Um, I think that'll do you good. I think that'll do you good. Okay. It doesn't pull out to a couch or, or to a full bed? No. It's no. just a sofa. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. But... Then, then you deserve the couch then. <laughs> okay. So, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, guys. Yeah. If, if that's, um, I'm sorry again. I didn't mean to. Um... Mm. And there's a knocking at the door. Mm. Are they looking for an autograph? Or... Oh, oh, yeah. For they me? probably have Spotify or something. Probably. Mm. Uh, I, I guess I can I can grab the door here. <clears throat> I open up the door and there's a a young youthful man who's fairly attractive standing at the door. Hey, hey guys, I saw you pull in. I saw the brewskis. Looks like you guys are down for a good time. Uh, my friends and I were on the other side of the lake here. Um, but we've just been kind of traveling around. We have a party going on today, tonight, Whoa. everything. We'd love to invite you guys. Yeah, man. Did you? Uh, do, uh, oh, yeah. Are you sure, guys? If like, you... do you have like a, do you have like an Apple phone That's... to give like five stars for anything? Uh, Wait, what'd you say? You said something? I did, sorry, I kind of blanked out for a second. I just heard. Have... And uh, well, I yeah, I use Apple products, bro. Like, nice. who yeah, doesn't dude, use Apple that's... products, dude? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I yeah, remember yeah. But my, my phone's Apple bike before I biffed it. But yeah, that's you chud. That's such a chud move. You bike, dude? Do you have a dude, bike? Yeah, dude? I bike. I have a dirt bike, bike back at the. Yeah, dude. dude so you guys should totally come that party that with us. Gone pro. Yeah. You're, like, like, oh, hey, I know. Have you been to Thunder Valley. Like Thunder Valley Motocross Park in Lakewood, California. Thunder Valley. Yes, dude. Yes. Uh, dude, you know that left turn where like you kind of go skirt and then you go ski? Bro. bro. <laughs> yeah, I know the left turn. Dude, I tore yeah, all I know of my ligaments turn, my leg on that one. Yeah. Could have oh, gone pro, no. but some people uh, say, you know, I didn't have it in me. But who's to say now that I can't? So, well, anyways, well, uh, you know what, they guys? don't call me Chud Nicholson for nothing because I'm tearing up that bike route uh, in my free time. But that's anyways. a good name, Chud. I like that. <laughs> hey, Chud. Some people Chud. think Chud. 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 I have done this since my time. I went to Thunder Valley Motocross Park. Oh man, that's awesome. <laughs> well, well, hey, you guys seem super cool, man. I'm gonna head back. You know they're clamoring for me over there. I bet yeah, I can yeah, hear man. them from here. Yeah, but I will you wanna, see you guys there. If you want a quick mm -hmm. brewski, mm -hmm. here. Let me just air to <laughs> my biggest fan. What's your name? What's your name, bro? Uh, Benson Car yeah. Nar I'm just gonna put the letter B, and you can oh, like. Sick. Yeah, here you go. Bro. Are you a guy who's like are that's, you like that's funny b i'll see you around man uh, okay yeah we'll see you there man yeah and then he takes off big gosh fan. big uh, fan. benson was pretty fucking sick don't you are think you, banks and uh i don't Benny? know man are you guys sure that we should go it's kind of like it just seemed well, i don't know like we had plans <laughs> and and like I, I i mean we don't know him you know what i mean so, yeah we'll change him yeah we'll change i, him. I completely agree Okay. Maybe they what need our think? couch for something. Like we can bring the couch to the well, party but too. I th I'm sleep. That's I where I'm love that idea. Pretty dope. Okay. <laughs> okay. We can. I guess. Um. Listen, we're all having fun here, and okay. if Nietzsche taught me anything, it would be like, <laughs> oh my god, the time that we spend with the bros. I'm paraphrasing here, of course. Obviously, come on, guys. But oh like, yeah, yeah. The yeah, time yeah, spent yeah. with the boys is more valuable than platinum. <laughs> I'm pretty okay. sure he said something like that. I read it. Okay. I th like I think platinum. Yeah. Like platinum. Like a bike is made of aluminum. And if I had a bike of platinum, I could have been making it big. And oh my god, existential crisis. Oh, he's losing. I'm... He's a little... No, I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. <laughs> I just sometimes the trauma from the bike. Oh, crash. Are you are you okay about that? Chud, are you okay? I, I, yeah, Chud, you're freaking out a little bit, man. I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah, it, it, it's just. People do you need don't to stay in? It, and and we don't need to go put the anywhere? left foot in front of the, the right foot, you know? Because I, I don't know who you that, you know, that guy. I just. 
if you guys want to go, I we can go, I guess. Yeah, we yeah, can all sure, yeah. Sure, sure. Listen, yeah, we're sure. all having a good time. Yeah, you know? you're right. Okay, okay. Benny, it's been so long, dude. It's been so freaking long. Oh, too long. God. Too long, man. You know, they say like Hollywood really like turns you around, and I just <laughs> I just feel bad. I feel nice to be back with you guys. You know what I mean? It, it feels Gosh. right. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and just you know, up top, just just for old times' sake. Up top, Boom. brother. Yeah. Boom. Oh, oh yeah. Not yeah. too hard oh, though. I, I do. The I hand missed, is really important I, for the I editing that. of the podcast. Really so I like... did miss. So I. No, that's okay. Um, Sorry, Banks. Okay. What was that? Banks. No, it's them? it's okay. No, I didn't. It's you were fine. muttering something. No, like, I didn't. Say... Your breath. No, I, I I didn't. I um. Nope. Awesome. Let's friggin' burn this couch down. <laughs> so we, we take a matchbook and we, we take go. so we light the couch on fire. Chud, 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 chud. You want to see this chud. again? And I take my bike and I go, I can't ride this shit anymore. And I strike a match off the back of it. Yeah. It's like it's like doing oh, a line off of that was where I was gonna crap. sleep. And I just flick That's... it into the couch. That's just... my bed. Okay. Um, maybe okay. So we burn the couch and all, <laughs> and then we head on over to that party. Yeah. It's party yeah. time. <laughs> Woo! With a bunch Ow. of Let's hot do single youths. <laughs> There's got to be a better way to word that, but yeah. <laughs> Can you say that one more time? Hot and single <laughs> youths. The FBI. Over the age of yep, they're on their way. They're absolutely on their way. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm hearing it. Now I'm hearing it. Yeah, yeah. Hot single twenty something. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we got it. We got you. It. <laughs> hey, hey, it's you guys from over the the other way, man. Come on. And Shane, what's popping, bro? What got? Hey, what's hey. up, brother, man? Yo, hey, Benson, I, I, have you met my boy, Benny? Yeah, dude, we were there. He's that nah. guy. He gave me the... the, we were the hanging, he's a big fan. Benson's a big, big fan, fan, man. man. He loves fan. it. He loves it. So I got to introduce uh, him to some people. Uh, thank you. Let's get some high fives. Yeah, and let's, let's meet him around here, man. Hey. Yeah. You're freaking uh, shredded here, Benson. You take athletic greens. You need a promo code, bro. Honestly, Ooh. dude. Yes, brother. Yeah, thirty-five percent off your first, your first order. Use no promo way. code Carlson, and you got no it, brother. No way, dude. Yeah. I knew you would come through. I saw you, Benny, when I showed up to the house, and I was like, "This dude's gonna come through." I don't know what he's coming through with, but he's gonna. Co- it was the brewski first, and I was like, "Maybe he's coming through with the beer." Gotta right? start with the brewski, and then Gotta start with the boom, brewski. the greens, man. The greens, <laughs> athletic or otherwise. The athletic or otherwise. Oh yeah. About, you know, okay, I'm gonna introduce you guys, uh, Tom. Tom, you got to meet these dudes. They're crazy, dude. <laughs> oh, what's up, guys? How's it going, man? I'm Tom. You guys seem like some cool dudes. I'm kind of running the shindig over here tonight. Uh, nice. nice. You guys, oh, Tom. You guys cool? Like Benson said you were cool, but are you guys cool? or? Bro, I'm yeah. cooler than like a thing that's cool, bro. <laughs> Have you even yeah. seen Chud's lack of ligaments, bro? Like... Dude, Look at how cool is this cool. is. I've been that wearing cool. straight up a boot since I was 13. There's Honestly, just, dude. There's straight up bone under there. There's nothing else. Like <laughs> that is cool. And <laughs> and boots in the summertime at the lake, dude. Honestly, wearing like having your attire not be appropriate for the weather is actually really cool. And that's kind of you know crazy. what they say. So like you guys are in with the fur. Am I right? Nice. Yeah, you guys are in Tree for reference. sure, dude. We're gonna let yeah. you guys stay in for for a while here, so mm-hmm. that's cool, man. Well, mingle, mm-hmm. have fun, chat. You know, tell your story. That's what we're all here to do, and and just have a good time. And Benny, man, you look you look really familiar too. Oh yeah, I listen. I get this all the time. Like if you want to autograph or whatever, like I got you covered, man. I appreciate the listens. They all they go a long way, you know, bro. 
Tom, you don't even get it. Benny's going pro, kind of like me, almost. But that one time, and yeah. But Benny, okay, legit. Psychologist right. talking yeah. Sigmund Freud. Oh, that's cool. We're talking, man. you know, um, Oedipus complex, the whole nine yards. Oh, sure. All of them, man. Benny, All of 100%. Them. That's that yeah. dude that fucked his mom, right? Benny, exactly. No, no. I, mean, I mean, no, Benny knows that guy. We all had a wild did summer, the thing. you know, back in the day. Wait, reverse it. Mom with Benny. In my defense. No, that doesn't make sense. In my sense. defense. Benny. In my defense, I, I thought she was a couch. So it was like. <laughs> I get that though, you know, because sometimes, you sometimes it's like, you know, the way that we kind of um, like treat our moms, it's like we're sleeping on them, you know what I mean? Like when you take a nap on a couch. Yeah. So, like, I get that, dude. And that then, like, intercourse. honestly, in some kind of way, we've, <laughs> we've all fucked our moms. <laughs> In you like, know, if you sleep, think about it, like in yeah, a way, if you think that's about true. it, sleep on them, nah, sleep with them yeah <laughs> you know if you there really just think about it now there that's it an interesting psychological think about like it. benny i feel like you guys think deep you know what i mean like you think like about things yeah does that like, make sense like i don't know if you ever heard episode episode 31 of my podcast it was i had on my college psychology professor and he had this quote that really stuck with me he said my office hours are over you're gonna have to leave and mentally what that means to me is like we all have places to be you know what i mean yeah. we can't stay anywhere together forever you know you gotta yeah. keep moving wait, wait 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 hold on hold on hold on hold on i completely agree <laughs> <laughs> that's that's one more listen that's one more listen right there that's really that's smart real. man that's yeah. there's an really... awesome blue apron hat in that one yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. I created well, a mascot for it called my blue ape Ron, and it's an uh, ape named Ron who's also whoa. blue. Um, they were not a fan of that. Like they cut the sponsorship dead in its tracks. Cause dude, that. if a blue ape named Ron was trying to sell me shit, I'm gonna buy it, dude. That's I'm what gonna I'm buy saying. it, dude. I That's don't care what, what it saying. is, man. I'm gonna I heard buy a, it, dude. A psychologist named like, you know, Jane Austen or something was talking about um, you I've know, heard that apes name, and dude. shit, bro. Like, yeah. like I think she's like, the girl in Thor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. dude, yeah. the god of thunder, anyway, man. Benny Shut knows up. all sorts of stuff about psychology. Speaking of which, yeah, I dabble. Has anybody seen Banks? Oh, yeah. And I'm just like, just cowering to myself, like, like 20 feet away from anybody else. Whoa, Banks, man. Are you okay? Oh, we're Banks, hanging bro. with Is there something uh, we said? a couple fans over there. I'm, I'm just, I'm just. They for sure subscribe. So like, what's the issue? I don't know. I just, I'm not, I don't, I just like, there's a lot of people and like, we had a thing going on. Yeah. So I just don't know, man. Like, I don't know any of these guys. Like, I don't, I don't. You know what if they have like d like a disease you know what i mean like if they or like maybe they're like criminals or something you know i don't know man like i just i don't like how how do you Listen, even know i get that i get that but like we're right near the water we're all having fun so beach party and then i push them <laughs> <No>! <laughs> dude you got them I'm got oh, oh <laughs> in the water <laughs> fuck Oh my god, you guys are, I can't swim. I can't, <laughs> what are you doing Banks, to me? Banks is so funny, I man. Can, got, got him. him. I got him. Got him. And I like scramble over and I <laughs> grab onto somebody's paddleboard. Holy shit. I'm so sorry. I just can't want to die. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we're all having Fucking a good time. Loser. We're all just kidding. Just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> And amongst the stories shared in the mingling, nighttime falls. And everybody is, you know, they're still keeping the party going. Yeah. But there is definitely a tonal shift. Mm -hmm. and suddenly, almost as if out of nowhere, there is an enormous shift amongst all the party guests. Woohoo! Oh, my. We're at a juggalo party. 
Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Benny. <laughs> Benny, I want to be that guy. Guys, I don't, I don't but know. Psychologically, what... how would you, you know, analyze people? I don't know, you guys. This, this is There's, different. Um... This is definitely different. Thanks. Hold on. Benny. Yeah, listen. Psychologically. Banks, like I come on, man. I took a semester of. Oh no, what is that in their cooler? Is that Fuego? Oh, uh, Hold yeah, I don't know what that this means, you guys. This isn't good. Um, yo, what up, ninjas? Whoop, whoop. Oh no, Bring those should be saying most of those things. What, what up, who? Biker? Whoop, whoop. Yeah, what's up, bro? Biker? Hey, what's up? Yeah, um, you guys, you guys down. Uh, we love, brother. Bit. Wicked clowns. Down eh? with the fitness, because I'm biking. Down yeah. with the clown, man. Yeah. Yeah, bang, hey. pow, right. boom, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Bang, pow, boom, man. Where did you get all the makeup from? We had man. it in the in the coolers. Uh, so we were ready to go. Oh, man. I. That's why my beer tasted so Do weird. Do you guys need yeah. some makeup? Um... Yes, Am and I, I think my boy psychology Benny here would love some, you know, hocus pocus. Guys, on this his is face. really weird. I don't know what to. This is. I feel like we shouldn't be here, Maybe bro. Just, I'm just trying to fit in. I don't know what the just fuck wrong. I'm doing. Yeah. Well, just... hey, this dude looks like he's down. So why don't you go first, man? Let's get some paint on your face, bro. And so I start painting Chud's face. Oh, yeah, just, man. Piggy just watch the legs. Just watch, boogie yeah, watch boogie the legs. woo, homie. Yeah, I know what I'm saying. So, anyways, That's Benny, wicked, how would you man. classify this in your psychological wicked. analysis from your uh, podcast? This is for sure okay. the id. I don't know, you guys. This is, is this super like weird. what this they call is, you know really different Oedipus or Freudian slip or something? This is like a super ego. I think that's a thing. Oh. <laughs> This dude's next. This little shy dude who's not saying anything, he's next. Oh my god, you guys. I don't Oh Banks, Banks, the... come on. you it's no big deal. Yeah, it's, it's just go with it, man. You know? Do whatever just you want with it. your face. Oh, no, man. oh yeah. they're giving him cornrows. Oh no. <laughs> how do I how do I look? I have half cornrows and then half like twisted up hair. How do I look, you guys? I don't I don't know what this is. I feel like we shouldn't Banks, be here, man. I, I wanna be like... that guy. But you look like a million bucks. Yeah, Cause, brother. Cause, whoop, whoop. Cause hey, bank. whoop, whoop. Yeah. Whoop, yeah. Whoop, yeah. Whoop. Yep. Whoop. Yep. Hey, Benny, don't worry. You'll get. Down you know, you don't seem very down, down, down with the clown. The clown. No, 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 I am, man. I am. Like I even I mean, had a yeah. name uh, five too. I'm really, ICP I'm really songs. Down with this thing. Of course, of course. Um, oh, come on, Benny. You got this. Okay. Okay. Um, Hey Benny, Benny, yeah. are you not down with the clown either? No, 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 no. Um, while we're talking out loud, I definitely am, man. I definitely, uh, yeah, am. yeah. Me, me too. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's got the tattoo of the guy with this. the hatchet. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. Um, yeah. Uh, you know what? I think I actually wrote up my top five songs and i gave it to tom earlier do you know where that guy's at or no, tom 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 comes tom. in oh he's so just close i thought dreadlocks some time <laughs> and, and just the most elaborate crazy face paint you've ever seen yeah let's oh, get yo, down. these dudes are super cool man uh no, you're up? sweating a lot yeah what's no, up? No. What's up? Mm -hmm. uh no i'm no. like really high what's up <laughs> yeah 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 no i'm uh, uh i was just saying like where's the face pain they at? said you, uh they said that they gave you uh you, that his top five because i asked yeah. him about five songs because he didn't seem like he was down no no no, no way no, no way like, man these guys got to be down down with yeah. the clown whoop whoop brother no like hey, i'm on up, spotify Nitra? they're on spotify like we're practically me and the uh aforementioned clowns are practically like brothers uh, you know, yeah, I mean, like, psychologically speaking, if you're connecting from one thing to another, uh, but bike speaking, I feel like this is kind of a chain and I'm more of a pedal, you know, like I like to be stepped on. 
Um, <laughs> these guys are crazy smart, actually. Like, yeah. 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 I'm pretty sure, know. like, Shaggy 2 Dope used my Casper mattress code at one point. So, like, we're, like, family. Are you talking purple Casper? You know Shaggy? The code? Uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I call him S dog you call him s dog that's cool s- man I, yeah, will, I, mean, I heard that only his inner circle calls him s dog dog oh yeah i guess is it s dog a... where you back out from a home uh, home ownership <laughs> such a deep cut. excuse me <laughs> dude that, does, really that sounds like that sounds like some thing. juffalo nonsense that you sounds like you're not down that? with the clown dude no. Are you trying to say shit about S Dog? Because that sounds like you're not down with the clown. If you're not down, like, oh. like Tom might be cool with you guys, but like, I'm running the show here now, and this 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 dark carnival might be hunting you down. We's going chicken hunting, and it looks like you guys might be the chickens here tonight. So we will grab our hatchets and we'll swing them to and fro, and you'll be on the flow for show. I gotta assume these are references to the band, but I, I just... Hey, no, me too. <laughs> I'm really struggling here, guys. None of this. I guys, don't know. I think, I, think we should, I think we should try to get out of here, man. This, 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 is, this is a little weird. I, I, I'm not... I don't, I've never been down. I don't know any... I, I, I don't like clowns. You don't like clowns, dude? Banks, come on, dude. Banks, All right, that's it. Bitch. Yo, 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 yo. Round, round them up. Let's get oh. them riders going. Okay, oh, uh, no. What is that? Is that a guy? I don't know. Then, boom, <laughs> boom. He ain't shit. Out of the trees, more and more juggalos are coming out of here. Whoop, whoop, how whoop, are they whoop, so whoop, high up? Jesus, man. We're surrounded with so much face paint. Ch- Chud, Chud, I, I think I see something. Who do you see? What? And in the distance. <laughs> <laughs> my shit, bro. Oh, I know a dirt I know bike. It. Okay, hop on. Chad, hey, I think you're run. the only way we can get out of here. Chad. Run like the wind, motherfucker! <laughs> and I hop on the bike. All three of us. Let's go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. I'm trying to hot wire it, and we see people go. getting really close. And they're getting they're real crying. close. Oh, they man. have hatchets, kendo <laughs> sticks. A, a very bizarre assortment of weapons that they shouldn't have. Oh my god, I'm way too famous to die, you guys. Oh, I can't. All right. I can't. I'm almost at triple digits. Hold on to your bridges. On the count of three. One, two, three. And then I, I'm just there. <laughs> Where are the pedals? Chud, man. We, I don't, don't want to be okay. like a... No. Ah, you start going hyper. <laughs> <laughs> I fall off the back. <laughs> Oh man, really? Maybe we should leave him. No, no, God. And then no, I take no. a sharp left and I biff it. Uh, oh, the left! <laughs> my, my left side was always my weakest. Oh. <laughs> Benny, oh. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it. You guys biffed not Benny. too far from me, so I crawl over to you. Bang. Assholes! Why would you leave me? Thanks. We biffed. Oh, we biffed. Oh my god. <clears throat> See, they're big. the juggalos are are approaching very slowly though, almost like menacingly. So they're we're crumping not like, as they walk. Yeah, we're, we're, <laughs> but we're not like in a huge rush because they're still a good distance away. But their <sighs> their paint shimmers in the moonlight, so we can see where they are. <laughs> oh my. God. Okay. Well, we should. I mean, safely because we have time, but we need to. We we should just go. I feel like we could lose them if we can get up, you guys. We got to get up here. Okay, yeah, we got to. We got to go. Because oh. like my couch got burnt, and I got dragged and had to socialize, and I got pushed into water, and my face yeah. got painted. I got called a juffalo. I don't know what that means, but they said names. No one does. And then I and fell I off a bank. <laughs> Get a hold of yourself, man. Did you biff it on a bike for a second time? Did you? Oh, no, I. It just. I fell off. I slapped you again. <laughs> Did you? I biff it so... on a bike a second time. No, no, no. But who's just... really the pathetic sack of shit? <laughs> In all honesty, I don't know. Because of his podcast, but it's really me. 
guys, we shouldn't be fighting like this over this. We're they're like kind of far away, but they are coming, so we need to be barely advancing. Yeah, they're barely advancing. They keep stopping to smoke and drink Fago, and then, then they continue on. Hey, you that that word's been appropriated, please. Let's so call it soda. It's, I'm sorry, there's soda. I didn't mean to <laughs> cause any controversy. I, I never even heard about it before today. I, I don't know. All I've been wanting, all I've been wanting, was a chill night with the bros. That's all lake. I wanted, and that's all I wanted. And just a little. That's all you guys wanted. That's all I wanted. That's all oh. I wanted, and maybe like a couple dozen more listens. Like if I handed out some business cards or whatever, but like. All I Benny, really want keep your realist or, or keep your expectations realistic. I you're right. I'm definitely definitely getting those couple dozen listens then. You're exactly. right. I got to Exactly. Hey, I have full faith in you. I'll listen to them 12 times if I have to. Thank you. I know most of the listens are from you. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Uh, in this short time, you know, we've <laughs> we've been doing this. I really feel like uh I've I I've just gotten to know you guys a lot closer yeah. uh but benny i have to be honest with you oh <gasps> yeah when am i gonna guest on your pod Every and what are you time guess on with this pod? chud come on chud you know chud, you are obsessed with this, this my schedule's kind of really busy it's got a you busy guys schedule. like yeah like you know, next week I got that guy from work who he is a guy from work next week. He found that five leaf leaves. clover. Like I can't let that yeah, pass that's, up. You're right. That's you're right, five right. leaves I'm sorry. on I got a clover. Ahead of myself, that's good. And SEO. then the the, the fucking um, juggalos are right next to us. <laughs> oh, Jesus. oh my gosh. Okay, and we're, so we like hobble away. We're still moving faster than them, so we're okay. Of course. Okay. Well, we have we, we if we just keep going, we can make it to the cabin, and I think we'll be okay. Um, okay. And we should be all right, right? They're like vampires, right? Like they won't come in if they if we don't let them, right? Right? That's I, I, I don't know so. anything I think about it's vampire this. Rules. I think, okay. Yeah. And Plus, so by the, the time the sun comes up, like their eyes are so dilated from the MDMA, like there's no way. <laughs> <laughs> that is that's true. That's true. That's true. Why well, see the cabin MDMA? Up ahead. Isn't that the group that rates movies? <laughs> <laughs> that's IMDb, Chad. Oh, I'm sorry. I... <laughs> Banks Never mind. loves Continue. IMDb. I love IMDb, actually. I don't f- watch a movie or form an opinion without <laughs> consulting IMDb. First, then who is the ERSB? That's who rates movies. Oh, I see what you're saying. Not they're That's exact... who says... That's who says if they're rated PG or R. And R. Or no, isn't that's that for video right. games? Or is that for every... All? Is that Fuck it, we gotta. I don't. We know, gotta go bro. because they're starting just, to catch up again. Yeah, we just stop to have these conversations <laughs> as we're being chased. But we continue to make our way over to the cabin, and we arrive. All right, guys, oh. we just gotta get inside, and we get inside. <sighs> we lock the doors. Whew. Juggalos gather around, Whew. but they can't quite figure out what they want. And they all just, shrug and just walk away. Just kind of loitering. They're just kind of loitering. Yeah, some of them take a seat, and they just kind of hang out, but they're not really trying to get in. I take a couple of my business cards and like push them through the slots in the door, <laughs> so they just like <laughs> fall to the feet of the juggalos outside. What's like, this? Listen, if they want to listen, like you know, I'm not going to deny a listener. You know what I mean? Give us a listen, right? That might be a five star review right there. You know what I mean? I That's can't a really pass good point. that up. I can't pass that up. Hey, we should listen to this, man. Yeah. Listen to them. Cool. They lo- That's cool. Love I'm always down for whatever, man. As long as I'm down with the clown, right? That's right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I think. Yeah, down with the clown or shit. Well, um, I guess, should we call it a night? I think, I don't know. I'm kind of game to call it a night. How about you, Benny? Yeah, you know, I think we had a pretty pretty eventful day but i just want to do one more one more quick thing before we kind of pack it in yeah uh, benny what's that banks what do you like what do you want to what do you want to do tonight like is there something you'd be interested in i completely like, forgot about banks i um <laughs> i don't even know where i'm sleeping and seeing <laughs> <laughs> 
the most depressing boys weekend <laughs> I've ever fucking heard. Not wow. only did it end with nothing happened, <laughs> but juggalos were involved. It was even worse. <laughs> Juggalo's slowly meandering <laughs> threateningly. <laughs> that right. is so funny. I am very disappointed. I didn't find a face makeup filter on Zoom. I so was I hoping that, that there was something. So yeah, I'll, 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 I'll figure something out, I'm sure. Yeah. All right. So <laughs> what a tale. What a tale. Part the, favorite part of the story. Oh, man. <laughs> I got to admit that twist i i, <laughs> I a, if if i can have a tie uh to to, to completely cheat the sure. rule of the segment here uh the twist of the juggalos and when we biffed it i i really enjoyed us <laughs> biffing so it on, on the left hand turn again the dreaded man, left that was very poetic man it was to biff it's it like on the left again it's like poetry it right it is you know? oh man absolutely what about you anthony favorite part of the episode I, am. I loved how my character was slowly getting more interested in Benny's podcast. <laughs> it was just really funny. And I that loved was how really... quiet Banks was through half of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like half the time like... it was me and Bob just going back and forth. And then Banks is just sitting there. I can imagine just anxiously. <laughs> Every once in a while, I'm like mumbling through your conversations with just like yeah. grievances I'm not willing to speak up about. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, I would say my favorite part. Oh, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. Michael, what was the, your favorite part? The biffing it was so funny <laughs> to have that come. Um, the juggalos barely approaching us. So the, yes. the thought of us just standing and talking for an, a long time whilst <laughs> being pursued. <laughs> It was very funny. Uh, I, I do want to send a shout out to to the juggalos coming out of the trees like <laughs> like ninja <laughs> assassins or something. Like, yeah. Right, hey man, that's that ninja <laughs> magic, magic ninja. What, oh, Bob? If God. you don't know that's this, good. I yep. was a juggalo for about ten years of my life. Wow, um, wow. So, <laughs> So um those references were flying out. Yeah, they were flying out a little too quick. I you know? dedicated so much time to it and I was like I'm never going to put this information all of these things I absorbed to use and now I did and can. So Michael, maybe I yeah. should start a Juggalo podcast. Ooh. As the great Malenko once said, what is Are you juggalo? googling Juggalo shit? Because <laughs> yeah. you wouldn't know these things. <laughs> But well, what is a juggalo? Uh, here's a super hot take. That's a song. For Amazing reference. Jekyll Brothers is better than The Great Malenko. Neither of you care about, about that or know what that means. But just about every juggalo right now is saying, fuck no, it's not. Um, it is. All, it is 100 all one million the of them listening. Yes. <laughs> hey, man, I've been to the gathering, concerts. I've done unbelievable amounts of studying mm -hmm. about the lore and there is lore there is very deep lore about it in icp's whole thing Bob, it's a it's a I, it's, wait, it's wait. a 10 year rabbit hole that i yeah one of the few things excuse me one of the few things i do know about them is that yeah they had some sort of cards or something that yeah led to this giant thing and oh my god you know a lot sense. more than you think you do bob I only know this because I think the ultimate answer was like Jesus or something. <laughs> but I'm not positive. Okay. It, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Michael, little are you anticlimactic. Being a juggalo right now? <laughs> I've done my time and I feel like I can gatekeep being a juggalo, even though I'm no longer a Bob, juggalo. Yes. Bob, do you know what Fago is? It's like a soda or something. Yeah, it's yeah, not it's bad. Not There's bad. actually really good flavors of it. I Although think I, I accidentally say, called it Fuego at one point because I couldn't remember the name. <laughs> it uh, is unbelievably heavy with syrup, though. It is like uh, the stickiest. Yeah, but they have like me. a they have a cotton candy flavor and like a a blueberry raspberry flavor or something like that. Those two are actually really really good. They also have. Uh, red pop, I think, is the flavor, and it just tastes like red licorice. Hmm. Um, so there are really interesting flavors. They have like a bunch of different ones, but uh, 
I will tell you this. So I went to an ICP concert in Minneapolis once and uh, it was a tiny venue. So it was packed and it was not fun. Uh, I fell down at one point, but thankfully jugglers are pretty cool and they cleared space and helped me on my feet. So that oh, was all right. That's nice of them. But it was not a big venue. So I literally couldn't move. I was like playing Dance Dance Revolution with my feet the entire time and I could <laughs> not move my hands. And they just spray so much Fago into the crowd. I had so much soda in my eyes, but I couldn't wipe it away. So I could barely mm. see the concert. I got hit, I think at least twice with a two liter bottle that was not empty Jesus. Uh, in the face. And I couldn't block it or do anything with my hands. Like you literally are just stuck there. And I got beat the shit out of by soda in that concert. This and that's is an part attack. of the experience though. This... That's literally just a part of the experience. How? It's not that fun. <laughs> But that's why people go. They hand out like Ziploc bags for you to put your phone in and stuff because you're going to be soaked by the end of the concert in soda. They shake Rough. them up. One of the things that's actually kind of cool, they shake up the two liters and then hold them upside down and twist the caps off and they launch like rockets into the crowd. And that's kind of cool to see, but it does yeah. suck to be showered in soda and then hit in the face with a two liter. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> I would say this is rough, but like I also went to a concert for Gogol Bordello. I don't know if you ever heard of them. They're a, is that a podcaster? They're, <laughs> they're, 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 they're what's known as a Ukrainian gypsy punk band. It's the most okay. fun concert I've ever been to. At one point, the main guy on stage opened up two bottles of wine and they rolled out a set of like Tyco drums and he just started beating them with the open wine bottles and the wine was spraying out into oh, the crowd. Wow. It was yeah. super that would metal. Be pretty it was cool. great. That would be wild. Yeah. And they also have like a 60 year old dude on violin. <laughs> that band, <laughs> that band rules. Check out Gogo Bordello. I will have, have to. That sounds crazy. One Anthony, do you have any? Ever. Any crazy concert stories? Me personally? Mm -hmm. No, nah, I don't go to concerts. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't no, been no, no, man. since I, I, I was a juggalo. I, no, dude. I, uh, I don't. I don't know. The only concert I really like taking the time to go see was the Lonely Island with Andy Samberg and all Whoa. of them, which was That'd be pretty fun, sick. Though. But that doesn't, you know, it's not like your normal concert. So I was just messed up when I saw it, and it was awesome. That was it. I don't really. That'd be yeah, fun I, though. I don't, I don't do any fun things. <laughs> I I will say this about Juggalo culture, it it's very unbelievably inclusive. Um, hmm. It's it's going to the gathering of the Juggalos is generally a very safe place because. Uh, part of the culture is a very family vibe amongst everyone. So you're really not worried about people fucking with you or your stuff. Um, anytime people get kind of heated or anything, it's pretty much broken up immediately. Like everybody's pretty wow. cool with everyone. So anytime, like when I went there, it's like you can just chat with people and everyone's just nice. Um, and going to concerts and stuff, everybody's just super cool. So I will say it, it is definitely, there are a lot of parts of the culture that I do not partake in and wasn't, but that was something that was pretty cool is like, even on this, if I was just in town and I saw somebody with like a hatchet man necklace or something, immediately we were cool with each other. So that's kind of a thing, but um, there's a lot of things that drove me away from the culture too, as I was no longer a teenager and then, some of it became not cool anymore. <laughs> Interesting. Became so, not cool. <laughs> <laughs> to it me, became yes. Interesting. Not Buell. It's it's oh, Ooh. that is true. Once it was not Buell, I was I felt a fool, to be honest with you. If it's not Buell, then I feel a fool. Bob, I do have a question for you. Certainly. Can you ask me one of the 99 questions right now on the podcast so people can get a sample? Nine. Oh, Bob, also, I don't know if you know this, on one of our episodes, I, or maybe it was on our episodes, uh, my ultimate goal in life is to be a guest on 99 Questions with Bob Buell. No, I heard it. I heard it. Okay. <laughs> you know, Michael, that he's is... pretty booked, actually. No, you know, I know. You know. That's why I'm like, His I need to be... schedule's pretty crazy. This, this <laughs> podcast needs to t take off so that I can feature on that show. I think that's a perfect goal. All right, Anthony, give me, uh, give me a number. 
You got the full uh, list right there. You know, I'm inclined to say 69, but for the sake <laughs> of, um, you know, the sanctity of this question, I'm going to go with 42. 42. This is a good one. Who? He's <laughs> so condescending. Oh, this is a good question that I came up with. <laughs> Uh, 42, who's the biggest celebrity you ever met in person? Ah, oh, damn. The biggest celebrity I've ever met in person. Uh, uh, myself, uh, in the future. Give me 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> fair. That's fair. Um, I met John Lewis, actually. Uh, Lewis. Former, uh, yeah, John Lewis, like the civil rights uh, activist. No, John Lewis. You like worked with Martin Luther King Jr. No, no. The I name I it sounds yeah. very familiar, but oh, am man. I racist oh, for this? Yes, you are. No, he passed away. He passed Not away a couple years ago. Not for this in particular, ago. but <laughs> I guess uh, it doesn't count as meeting because I just saw him. That's not meeting. I don't think I've ever met a celebrity in person. Like had an interaction with of some sort. Uh, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Okay, John oh. Lewis, he's dead. He doesn't matter anymore. Uh, <laughs> sorry, the family of John Lewis. <laughs> the, the great John Lewis. He's phenomenal. Yes. No, um, I don't know. Rooster Teeth makes, uh, says anything or means anything to you, but uh, RT, yeah, uh, Jeff Ramsey and Jack Patillo I met. Oh, but that was like for a little like... photo op. That was about it. Right. It's still super cool, though. Nothing well, wrong with 42. that. I I've interviewed a couple of uh, Funhouse uh, people, uh, you know. They're kidding me. Yeah. Uh, I mean, they're more modern people, but Ryan Haley uh, from nah. Funhouse and John Smith. Uh, Damn. Nah, nah, ma'am. Yeah, that's, that's I, uh, past I'm your time, I think. Is he related yeah. to Joseph Smith? Uh, of the Mormon religion? Correct. He actually, Is he related to the, yeah. to the invisible hand, John Smith? That's also correct. <laughs> He interrupted the show so many podcast, times. <laughs> <laughs> Could I answer a question too, Bob? Of since course. we're being no. honored with, with your show. You, I'll take get... number... It, since this is episode 70, I'll take question 70. Oh, boy. Oh, this is not the most exciting, but it's pretty good. Okay. Question 70. Have you ever had any good nicknames? <laughs> um... I've had many nicknames, 90% of which I've given to myself. <laughs> uh, if those don't count, really the only nickname I've... Well, I, I'll say two. Okay. Uh, one is sentimental. The other one is kind of funny. So Ooh. one is Mikey. Uh, my grandpa has called me Mikey my entire Ooh. life. And he... Uh, un until I started kind of using it in other ways, was pretty much the only person to ever call me that. So that's kind of a sentimental way, and I'm fine. I don't go by Mike ever. Uh, I always go by Michael, but Mikey is fine because of that. So that's kind of one. The other one. So I started rapping when I was about 13, and mm -hmm. I was in the seventh grade talent show, and I was super nervous. Uh, I was definitely not a cool kid. So going out and doing this, I was petrified. But uh, one of the hosts wanted to know if she could announce me in a special way. And so she announced me as Pimp Dog Michael. And Ooh. that was uh, a thing for like a year or so. No, this was eighth grade, but still. Yeah, so Pimp Dog Michael was eighth a nickname I had for a little dog. bit before I... Eighth grader Pimp Dog. Yep. That before I, like I, I eventually... <laughs> I eventually ditched the name, uh, <laughs> but yeah, that was a nickname I went by for a little bit. Until was, uh, today. And until now, today. henceforth, <laughs> I'll be Pimp Dog I'll Michael. I'll be Pimp Dog Michael. That's a good Love name it. to have. Yeah, so oh. that's uh, those, I suppose, are the two. I, I've given several nicknames to myself more for stage name purposes, Wu-Tang style. But... Nice. How every member of the Wu Tang Clan has like seven nicknames, <laughs> but which yeah. I love. I oh yeah, oh yeah, love it. Fantastic. All right, well, we can probably start wrapping up. I see the eight minute timer down on the, <laughs> on the Zoom. Good app. Good app. Good story. Great. App. Great this was incredible, Bob. Thank you yeah, very thank much. Thank you so this much, was Bob. An honor. It was a delight. Please plug your things before we take off. Oh yes, please. Well, 
Yeah. Hey, is... plug me, Bob. <laughs> if I had a nickel every time. <laughs> uh, uh, first off, thank you so much for having me. This was a, a right. ton of fun. Uh, if I can promote anything, go and give this show uh MA's adventure. No, MA's a- excellent, excellent adventure. adventure. Dang it. I, I had one shot. I messed that's, it up. <laughs> it's okay. Idiot. That's what post op- <laughs> that's what post editing is for, right? There you go. <laughs> give this podcast uh, a thumbs up if you're watching it on YouTube. Give it a five star if you're listening to the audio. Whatever you're doing, uh rate it. It literally takes you two seconds. And I know every time I see a little uh, rating on my show, uh, it gives me a little, little, just a little boost of serotonin that day. And it means a lot. So do that right now while you're listening to this. Uh, and then it'll make me plugging my thing uh, just so much faster. Uh, my show is 99 Questions, the number 99. It's it's an audio podcast that I'm, I'm super proud of that I've had some really amazing guests on um, who I, I super look up to. If you like uh, people in the video game realm, I've had folks from uh, the website Giant Bomb, Game Informer, um, uh, uh, people who design video games, Nina Freeman, uh, people uh, in the comedy world, Jeffrey James, Riley Anspaw, Cicely Bro, uh, people in the acting world, people in the uh, writing world, people in the music world. I, I'm an uh, episode coming up with a, a digital music producer, Too Mellow, who does video game soundtracks. Uh, I had on Bill Oakley one of the writers the showrunner for the two best seasons of the simpsons who wrote who shot mr burns and the holy Steve cams bit like i that did was like, see that you posted that yeah it was like meeting my idol uh insanity uh, i had the co-host from the current version of let's make a deal the other white guy from whose line uh <laughs> jonathan mangum i've 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 had on Sam Reich, the pres the CEO of College Humor. Like I, I'm shocked every time people say yes, and we got more coming down the pike. So uh, if any of this sounds of any interest, 99 questions on your audio podcast medium of choice. Uh, but truly, guys, thank you so much for having me. This is a ball. Oh, thank you for being here, Bob. This has been a ton of fun. Uh, guest episodes are always a good time, and and you will be welcome back at any time uh oh because yeah. turns I, out you're a heck of a storyteller uh, <laughs> i'm i'm gonna be giggling over the word biffed it for the next <laughs> at least the next three days i know that for good a fact. good 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 <laughs> uh yeah and for us i mean bob already pretty much plugged our stuff <laughs> um so thank you that was very nice of you bob we really appreciate it thanks um, for plugging me bob yeah, thanks for blowing me. Anytime. <laughs> I'm, I'm here to fill that gap. Oh. <laughs> Someone say fill I, that you tease. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, with four and a half minutes left, uh, I just want to thank everybody for listening. Uh, hope you had a good time. Catch us next week uh, as we have no guests lined up. So that's not quite as exciting, but it'll be a lot of fun as it always is uh like us on all the things and if you have a premise for a short story uh feel free to email us at michael and anthony adventures at gmail.com we love doing the submitted premises uh those are a lot of fun as well feel free to dm us on anything as well twitter instagram facebook the we've gotten some dms such as stop and why and those are always fun to open so (laughs) feel free to message us um We just want to have a good time and want to include all of you. So with that, Anthony, I think we should wrap her up. All right. Thank you very much, everybody, for listening. And bye-bye. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, Bob. And kisses. Bye.